Sun now it's recording, yeah? So, focus on me, yeah. Hi right, folks, hope you're okay today. We're here to share the word of God. Romans chapter 1. Romans chapter 1, verse 16 says, For I'm not ashamed of the gospel, I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, for it is the power of God unto salvation. For I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Christ. For it is the power of God unto salvation. Why are we not ashamed of the gospel today? We're not ashamed of the gospel. It says, I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Christ. <coughs> Excuse me. But it's the power of God unto salvation. I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Christ because Christ is the Son of God. As the Son of God, He came to die on a cross. As the Son of God, He came to die. As the Son of God, He came to die on a cross. And He gave His life for us on a cross. He shed His blood for us on a cross. It says, God demonstrates his own love to us that while we were yet sinners Christ died for us he died on that cross for you and me today whatever you have done wrong whatever I have done wrong he was nailed to that cross he was nailed to that cross to bring us home he shed his blood as a savior he shed his blood on that cross to cleanse us and to wash us so that we could be forgiven Jesus says I am Jesus says I am the way the truth and the life no one can come to the Father but through me and he is the way he is the truth and he is the life and if you come to him if you trust in him if you believe in him today you can be forgiven you can be restored and cleansed it says the blood of jesus christ cleanses us from all sin the blood can cleanse you the blood can bring forgiveness the blood can bring restoration the blood can bring mercy the blood can bring kindness. The blood can bring restoration. The blood was shed on a cross for all the things that you and I did wrong. The blood of Jesus. There is power, power, wonder-working power in the blood of the Lamb. There is power, power, wonder-working power in the precious blood of the Lamb. <laughs> there is power, power, wonder-working power in the blood of the Lamb. There is power, power, wonder-working power in the blood of the Lamb. There's a way home to heaven. There's a way home to know God. There's a way to be forgiven. There's a way to be restored. The way to be forgiven and the way to be restored is to know that he died on that cross, a cruel death, nailed to that cross for you on that cross, that you may live and have life eternal. Jesus says, I've come to give life abundant, more abundant. And he wants to give you abundant life today. Abundant life in Christ. Peace in Christ. Love in Christ. And the mercies of Christ today. Come to me, all you who are weak and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon me and learn of me. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light.
So go to Jesus today and look to him as your Savior and your Lord. He gave his life for you on that cross. He shed his blood for you on that cross. He gave his all for you on that cross. He died a cruel death. He died hanging on a tree. He died crying out, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? But he died to reconcile us to God. He died to reconcile us to God. He died to bring us home to God. He died to save us. He died to give us hope and blessing. So come to Christ today. Come to him as your Lord and Savior. Come to him as your King. Come to him and believe in him today. May you know him as your Savior today. May you know him as your Lord today. May you know him as your God today. Christ who died on a cross. He hung on a cross and shed his blood on a cross for you. He hung on that cross and shed his blood that you may live. He died in agony. He died to save you. He died to give you hope. He died to give you a future, to give you a plan and a purpose. All right, mate, have a lovely day, yeah? God bless you, yeah? He died to give you a future and a purpose and a plan and a hope. He's a nice guy, but I don't... I don't, I don't, I don't. Uh, 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 he died to save you. He died to give you hope. He died to give you a future. He died to give you a purpose and a plan. He died to bring you home. My friends, come to Jesus. Come to know him as your Lord. Come to know him as your Savior. Come to know him and be reconciled to God. Come to know him and be restored in God today. Come to know him as your Lord. Come to know him as your Savior. Come to know him as your God. Come to know him, my friends. Come to know him today and believe in him. It says in the word of God, you must be born again. Born again of the Holy Ghost. Born again of the Holy Spirit. Born again of Jesus. Born again of the Lord. Born again of the Savior. Born again of Christ the King who save you and give you a hope and a future. Satan is destroyed on the cross. <laughs> Satan is destroyed at the cross. And he came to die on that cross to give you a hope and a future, a plan and a purpose. So turn to him today and trust in him today. Have faith in him today. May you know his love today. May you know his grace today. May you know his salvation today. May you know his peace today. May you know his kindness and grace today. He is a savior. He is a savior that will save you. Keep, keep filming, I just put that there. He is a savior that will save you. Whatever you do, don't. Don't plan on to die over there. Right? Where the, you know, the little ones are. Oh, yeah. Just plan, plan on me, just plan on me, yeah. <laughs> He is a saviour that gave his life for you. He is a saviour that shed his blood for you. For me, to live is Christ, to die is gain. To die is gain, to know Christ, to love him and believe in him and trust in him. And he can give you a hope and a future today. It can give you a life today, a purpose today, a plan today in your life. To be reconciled to God, to know God, to, to believe in God, to, to know that he's your saviour to know that he's your God, to know that he's your Lord. You can be saved today in Jesus. You can be saved today in him. And know that he's your savior. And know that he's your God. He can wash you. He can clean you. He can make you anew. He can make you a, a child of God today. But drugs will not save you. Wacky backy will not save you. Crack cocaine will not save you. He'll not save you. Crack cocaine will not save you. Getting drunk will not save you. But Jesus will save you. He will save you. He will give you a future. 
He will give you a purpose. He will give you a plan. If you believe we evolved from apes, you believe it in a myth. It's a myth. We did not evolve from apes. It is a myth. You're believing a lie. You're believing a myth. We did not evolve from apes. It is a myth. It is a myth. You believe in a myth. It is a myth. We were created by God. We were created by God. Sorry, sorry, Sean. Sorry. It's flashing to you. Let's have a look. Battery. Sure it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah.